Hey up everybody, on to the next part of Jigsaw now I'm moving on to the blower and all its components uh, Before I move on to the blower I'll just show you on local I've been moving my pressure gauge to a different port in manifold So I'll just show you that what I've been doing there then we'll continue with this blower Right, I've just moved my pressure gauge from this uh, this top port hole in my manifold onto the side. The reason I've done that is because I've, I'm putting a smaller cab on, on the meter made and the cab only comes to somewhere there where the safety valves poke through. And just briefly, the blower is going to come from this valve here somewhere down probably centre line of the boy, the uh, firebox and boiler and then it's going to come through the cab and work its way down to, towards the smoke box right then back onto the workbench and I'll just explain this um, this layout of the, all the blower components uh, if you're going to make all these components yourself, and like I've done, I've not bought any, I've made everything. There's, there's approximately 20 components there. That's excluding all the components in the globe valve and the elbow, which I've made in separate videos. So, coming through the smoke box then, there'll be a piece of eighth pipe. Uh, that's going to go up the side of the blast pipe. Then I'll have a union nut, an olive and a locking nut that's going to clamp the elbow to the smoke box wall here's the elbow then coming off this elbow I'm coming with an olive and a union nut and then because I've not got a piece of 1 8 pipe of a suitable length but I've got plenty of 5 30 second pipe I'm coming through with 5 30 second pipe and I'm going to reduce it down to 8 at the smoke box that's effectively making it 1 8 all the way through so I've had to make a reducer from 1 8 to 5 30 second then there'll be a piece of 5 30 second pipe an olive sorry a union nut an olive and then where the cab wall is I'm coming through with this union so I can split the pipe work into two parts if I ever need to take the cab off and then on that union there'll be this locking nut that's going to clamp the union to the cab wall then there's an olive, a union nut and a piece of pipe onto this union and then a piece of 30 second pipe coming up the boiler to the globe valve and that will be finally fastened on with a union nut and an olive so we'll move over to loco now and I'll make a start putting these on right I've just roughly put the tank on on some blocks to determine where my blower pipe can come through and the, I found the best place for it to come in my case I'm coming I'm going to come underneath the tank I've drilled my hole there and I'm going to put my union on there now what I've got to do now I've got to I've just got to determine how much pipe I need I'm going to come up the boiler in a straight and vertical line then I'm going to come horizontal across to here then I'm going to go up round the boiler to pick the valve up ok then I've cut, cut a piece of pipe 15 inch long and I've put a 1 inch bend on one end and what I'm going to do now I'm going to solder this olive on to this end then I can fasten this union To this end of the pipe then my plan is because it's a bit tight at the bottom of that cab I can then thread once I've got my pipe bent to go up to my valve I can thread the pipe through the hole, the hole in the cab put my, nut, my locking nut on from the other side and then I can get my union nut and my pipe on the other side of the cab to come up past the, t the tanks
I've got the pipe work connected now to the valve and that's going round there down to that union the union's coming out at the bottom of the cab and what I've got to do now then I've got to make another piece of pipe exactly the same procedure to go across towards the boiler up to the centre line and then across here to the smoke box for the elbow OK that's the other pipe made now I've got the nuts fitted union nuts it's exactly the same as first pipe it's just a bit longer that's all so that's going to fit onto the union cab like that and then I've got my blower elbow which I made in a previous video the long side's going to screw into the smoke box with the locking nut at the other side and then this end's going to fit onto that So I've just got the uh, one eighth pipe to put in the smoke box that goes up the side of the blast pipe. So I suppose there's only one thing to do now and that's go and fill the boiler up with air and try it. That's it then blower complete and tested so uh, I'll move on to the next part at Loco in my next video so I'm going to sign off for now then thanks for watching bye for now